After spending months on house arrest, NBA Youngboy is finally going to court. The rapper was first arrested in March 2021 for possession of a firearm and ammunition as a convicted felon. A month prior, the feds had opened a case in connection with the previous arrest in his home state of Louisiana. Rather than taking a plea deal, Youngboy has decided to take it to trial and his court case began this Tuesday, July 12th. In late 2020, the rapper was arrested alongside 15 other individuals after cops raided a music video shoot in Baton Rouge, where they confiscated multiple guns and narcotics. Youngboy is not allowed to be near any illegal drugs or firearms as a convicted felon, so he was quickly arrested. YB was initially let out on bond in Louisiana, but after the feds announced that they were picking up the case, he was re-arrested in LA after a lengthy police chase. The day after he was arrested, a California magistrate granted him bond which included $540,000 in cash and collateral in the form of two homes worth $1.5 million, along with stipulations that he wear an ankle monitor and agree to be drug tested. But because the crime happened in Louisiana, the conditions of the bail also had to be approved by a judge in his home home state. Initially, the Louisiana judge decided to revoke his bond, citing a history of probation violations and a pattern of violent behavior as cause to keep him in jail. But in a stroke of luck, the judge eventually agreed to reverse her decision after his lawyers promised to keep him under strict supervision at an estate in Utah with 24-7 armed security. Youngboy was released from jail on October 29th and immediately placed under 24-hour home confinement at a residence in Layton, Utah. Since then, he's been releasing music and waiting on his trial. Finally, Youngboy will get his day in court and his team even secured an early victory. Prosecutors wanted to use lyrical evidence from one of his songs to connect him to a gun, which his lawyers managed to get thrown out. In the song Gunsmoke, Youngboy raps about an FN, which is an automatic pistol, the same kind of firearm that was found in Youngboy's vehicle when he was arrested. Prosecutors tried to use this as evidence to prove that it was his. But Youngboy's lawyers argued that this was highly prejudicial, stating that even if Mr. Golden is familiar with various models of guns and sings about them, it does not mean that he knew this particular gun was secreted on the passenger floor of the main back when the police attempted to pull his car over to arrest him. In another strange turn of events, one juror was also excused after reportedly telling the judge that he was a fan and would decide in Youngboy's favor. Twitter account at Lawyer for Workers, a profile run by Mo Gangit, who often comments on hip hop related cases, broke the news. According to the tweet, when asked by the judge whether he would be able to decide fairly in the case, juror number seven responded, I love YB and I would decide in his favor. Not too long after, juror number seven was dismissed. So it seems like YB stands have even influenced traded the courtroom. Youngboy is potentially facing up to seven years if convicted, although his lawyers seem confident that he may get off without serving any additional time. Whatever the outcome, the dismissal of lyrical evidence is a significant win for both Youngboy and hip-hop in general because it has been seen in many recent cases where rap lyrics have been used as evidence, the latest example being the YSL indictment. But fans will just have to wait and see whether the judge ultimately rules in Youngboy's favor. Subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with the latest news in hip-hop and check out our other videos for exclusive content and more. I'm your host Luesta and this is Rap TV. TV.